Hey guys, welcome to Locate for Sight. I'm Marcus, music producer, lighting director, programmer and official MA trainer. This is MA Quick Tips. In this video I want to show you a way how you can save up your flash or temp buttons for busking environment. So normally you would grab your fixtures, go to MA Tricks, make a grouping of three. Let's press the next button. Lights at 100%, store it, next. 100% next 100% and store this and then create a temp button of this and then you have now these three temp buttons. If you do it like this then you need three buttons for this action and even if you have a full size for a busking show you can never have enough buttons and you will run out of buttons very very soon. I show you how I do that. So let's erase these sequences Let's select the fixtures, go to MATRIX, say grouping of three, press next, add add, store it, SQ1. Next, add add, store it, SQ2 in the same sequence, next, add add, SQ3. So, what we have created here now, this is Q1, Q2, Q3. It's not what we wanted, but yeah, it is. So, let's now go to edit settings and disable tracking. When disabling the tracking, then we don't need to douse the other lamps and the other cues. So let's say Q1, Q2, and Q3. So this is cool, but we want a temp button for that. So we've already created a temp button, but by clicking, it's only going to hit the first cue. So let's say edit settings and change the behavior of the restart mode. And I'm going to set the restart mode to next cue. And now, always when I'm pressing, it's going to start the next queue. So it would look like this. So you see, we are nearly there, but um, now I would like to have a small fade out. So I'm going to add the off queue and the fade time of the off queue. Let's put point 3 on it. And now we can hit this temp button. And we have a three step chaser with just one button instead of three buttons. I really love this feature to do all my DM masking shows because it saves a lot of space. Thanks for watching, see you next time, bye bye.